accepting choice movie action adventure for X-Men Origins Wolverine. That is dedication. Look at that. <laughs> How you guys doing? Love you too. I used to be the only Australian in the world who didn't have a surf ball. Now I got one. Thank you very much, everyone. This is a... Uh... <laughs> the Wolverine fans up the top there. I see you. Bring them. So, uh, this is a huge moment for me and for my kids, not the award, but the fact I'm on the same stage as the Jonas Brothers is big for my kids. But uh, I've been putting on the course for about 10 years now, so it just goes to show if you practice hard enough, you eventually get it right. Thank you very much, everybody. And maybe, uh, who knows, maybe Wolverine will use one of these when he heads to Japan. See you in the next time around. Thank you. Don't go anywhere. Miley Cyrus is about to honor Britney Spears as your ultimate choice. She is quite simply the best-selling female artist of the decade. And Jonas Brothers confront their biggest dare yet. I really hope he likes me. I really hope he was at least 18. How old is he? 16. 16? God, I'm such a cougar. Then we find out how big a night this will be for the stars of Twilight. You won't want to miss this. So if you had to give the Jonas Brothers something to do, what would you dare them to do? Uh, shove two ice cubes up their noses for 10 seconds. And now what would we do with the ice cubes after they come out of their noses after 10 seconds? They could sell it on eBay. That would make a lot of money. Oh, yeah. I'd wear baggy clothes. I would dare them to walk into a crowd of girls with their <laughs> Okay, everybody, it's time again once to play the game that's sweeping the nation. They're the Jonas Brothers. That's you, buddy. Yeah. Our third and final dare is for Brother Nick. This dare is the most exciting and dangerous of all because it involves the most special people on Earth, the Jonas Brothers fans. We have 20 of the most dedicated and intelligent fans on stage right now. Hello. Nick, let's find out what your dare is, okay? I dare Nick Jonas to hug as many fans as he can. Wow. Okay. From Nick J. Here's how it's gonna work. Nick, you have just 20 seconds to successfully hug all these fans. And let's just be clear, it's just hugs. You're not going for long-term relationships here, girls, okay? Okay. After 20 seconds pass, our referee Joe will blow his whistle. You know I'll do anything for the fans. I'm up for it. You will do anything for the fans. Now if I see any holding girls, I'll blow my whistle, okay? No longer than five seconds. You got that? Five Nick, seconds. are you ready to play? Let's do it. Okay. Let the hugging begin. Go! Woo. Kim, settle down now. Kim. Up. You, all right, that was good. You got two more, Nick. Why don't you just finish it? All right, good job. To present a very special award, please welcome once again, Miley Cyrus. Thank you. 
The Ultimate Choice Award is our highest honor. And this year, it goes to the first star to ever step on stage at the very first Teen Choice Awards. She not only introduced the world to the show, but she also got one of the very first surfboards for Choice Single for her one of her many classics, number one, Baby One More Time, of course. That was just the first. That was just the first of an amazing eight surfboard she has collected over the years, as well as countless other music awards. She is quite simply the best-selling female artist of the decade. Take a look. the highest grossing tour of 2009 hits the U.S. again later this month. I'm a huge fan of hers, and I'm so thrilled and honored to present the Ultimate Choice Award to the Ultimate Teen Choice Star, the ringmaster of the whole circus, the one and only, my hero, Britney Spears. From the bottom of, of my heart, thank you so much, and God bless. Coming right up, Josh Jumel reveals how many Teen Choice Awards Twilight has won. And the Jonas Brothers perform their newest hit, next on Teen Choice 09. That's right, let's start with music. Your choice R&B artist is Beyonce. 